Hello and welcome to my channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Rachel. I am the girl with the Pilates mat and it's really lovely to have you here. Thank you for joining me today. Today's workout is about 17 minutes and it is a standing Pilates workout and the exercises in it, there are exercises to challenge your balance, to strengthen your legs, to strengthen your upper back and uh, to give you a little bit of a cardio boost as well so I hope you enjoy it uh, do go ahead get yourselves ready and I'll see you in a moment okay let's just start with a gentle warm-up so we're going to bring the shoulders up back and around up back and around up back and around, up back and around, up back and around, and up back and around. You're going to breathe in to lift the arms up, breathe out, stretch them out to the side. So you can inhale up, exhale out, deep breath in, and exhale out. Inhale and exhale out. Well done, one more. All right, we're gonna do a little stretch of the neck, so tilting the head over to the side and coming back up. Be very gentle, just only go as far as feels okay for you. And coming up, good. So inhale as you go over and exhale up. Inhale over and exhale up. Two more, over and exhale up and over and exhale up. We're going to do a little turn looking towards our right hand side and come back to the center and then over the other way and back to the center. Over and back, over and back two more over and back and over and back now i want you to think about bringing your tummy muscles in and lifting up so we're standing up as tall as we can i'm going to go sideways so you can see what we're going to do next you're going to bring your arms up so you've got your elbows in line with your shoulders like so and then I want you to open the arms out squeeze the bottom of the shoulder blades together release and come around I'm going to turn my back to you so you can see the back view so you open you squeeze the bottom of the shoulder blades together you release and you come back let's try that again open squeeze release and back open squeeze release and back open squeeze release and back one more open squeeze release and back and i'm going to turn around so you can see the next thing that we're going to do so you're going to open squeeze now turn your palms forward reach up towards the ceiling and do a nice little look up if you can. You're gonna feel this in your upper back and you're gonna bring the arms all the way down. So you're gonna lift them up, you're gonna open, you're gonna squeeze the bottom with your shoulder blades and now keeping that squeeze, turn your palms forward and try and reach up. Take it nice and slow, so trying to mobilize all your upper back and then bring the arms down. So let's try that again. We're going to lift up, we're going to open, we're going to squeeze the shoulder blades together, turn the palms forward, reach up, stretch, arms out to the sides. Quite a strong movement, isn't it? So we're going to lift up, we're going to open, squeeze the shoulder blades together, turn the palms forward, reach up, arms out to the side. Let's do it one more time. So we're going to lift up, we're going to open, 
we're going to squeeze the shoulder blades together we're going to reach up arms out to the side and down well done very good all right so from here let's bring our arms up interlace the fingers take the hands behind the head okay so think of a nice standing posture and think of how drawing your head back into your hands so you can feel that little elongation through your neck and you're going to inhale as you go over to the side I want you to feel a nice stretch through the side of that body and then exhale to come up then the other way inhale over and exhale up inhale over and exhale up inhale over and exhale up good inhale over and exhale up one more inhale over and exhale up now think of keeping your hips nice and still you're going to exhale you're going to try and rotate your rib cage to the right hand side and come back and then the other way rotate and come back and again rotate and come back and rotate and back two more and back and rotate and come back well done you're going to bring your hands forward now let's just do the wrist to finish the upper body so we're going to go round two three four five six seven and eight and in two three four five six seven and eight well done let's bring those arms down so we're going to go on to our leg work and we're going to have a few little balance challenges for you today so what we're going to start doing is you can have your hands on the hips for this one you're going to try and bring one leg up and take it down other leg up and take it down so it's a lift and lower lift and lower. so trying to bring that knee up to hip height if you can but certainly you don't have to go any higher than that little lift and lower lift and lower if you're finding this is a challenge you can hold on to a chair or you can just make it smaller like this just to get used to lifting one foot in the air all right if you're feeling you, you can take it a little further you're going to lift and down lift and down lift we're going to do a few more than we've done in previous videos just to get that heart rate up a little bit all right here we go eight seven six five four three two one and down now we're going to add to that make it a little bit more challenging take your feet a little wider and soften your knees okay and then what you're going to do from here is you're going to bend the knee come up little balance and down so you're going to do a lift and down a little lift and down i want you to think as if you're pulling up through that tummy as you come up and down up and down up and down one more up see if you can hold it for five four three two one and come down how was that quite a challenge wasn't it challenge for me too so let's do the other side are you ready so a little softness on the knees okay they don't have to be too bent but you want to feel a little bit kind of springy okay so working those muscles so you're going to come down up down up down and up down and up good four three two holding the last one one and hold for five four three two one and down excellent so we're going to try that to the side now so i would suggest you have your arms nice and free you can use them however you want for this all right so we're going to bend the knees we're going to go up and down up and down up and down lift and lower four three you're going to try and hold the last one two one and hold for five four three two one 
and come down well done let's do the other side so nice and soft on those knees here we go up and down up and down lift and lower lift and lower four three two one hold for five four three two one and come down you can feel your heart rate is lifted a little which is what we want now we're going to turn and do the back this one's always a little bit of a challenge so you've got your knees bent you might want to tilt forward just a little bit but try not to let that tummy go okay so keep the tummy pulling in as you can hear i'm slightly out of breath which is all good hope you are too so we're going to bend soft knees lift up <sighs> lift and lower lift and lower lift and lower that's it four three two one hold four five four three two one and come down as you can see that wasn't easy for me either all right let's do the other side then so nice softness on the knees let's take those arms forward draw the shoulders down here we go lift up and down up and down up and down up and down four three two one and hold for five four three two one and come down well done all right so from there just take your feet wide and we're just going to move from side to side it's just to do a little loosening up of those hips so gently does it keeping the legs straight just moving side to side side to side five four three two one well done and then from here I want you to turn the feet out just a little draw the tummy in tucking under and I want you to bend your knees as much as you're able and I want you to look down at your knees and check that they are going over your toes you don't want the knees coming in like this because this will hurt your knee joints all right so you take those knees back now if for any reason this doesn't work for you you can have your knees parallel okay so knees going forward that's your other option but the turnout must come from the hips all right so from here you're going to bend the knees bring the arms up and then press down so nice and upright with that spine imagine you've got a steel rod in the back of your t-shirt yeah so you've got to stay really straight and four three two one now hold it here take the hands behind the head and then I want you to do a little rotation and back little rotation and back one more time and then lifting back up you can feel that in your thighs can't you let's do this again so we're going to bend and up bend and up bend and up bend and up four three two one staying down interlace the fingers hands behind the head exhale rotate and back rotate and back rotate and back and back four three a little longer two one and coming all the way up well done come on up shake those legs out all right and let's just do a little movement for the foot so you're just going to bring the right foot forward these are all functional movements to get you moving okay so hands on the hips and then all you're going to do is lift the foot up onto the toes and take it down so we're just bending at the base of the toes metatarsals and down bend and down bend and down bend and down one more bend and down switch legs 
Very simple movement you might think, but the idea is to give you functional movements as well as challenge you a little bit on your balance. Okay, so we're lifting up and down and down. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. One more. And lower. Good. Now come back to that right foot. And we've got the foot flexed and we're going to lift it in the air. I've done this before on a previous video. We're going to do circles this time. So circle out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Other way. In. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Bring that foot in. Let's take the other one out. So we're flexing the foot to start with. All right, draw the tummy in. Think of lifting up through that body. Then lift the foot up. Circle out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight. Well done. All right, so shake it all out now. All right, and that's going to be more or less it for today. We're just going to finish with a little energizer. So let's have those feet hip width apart. You're going to inhale, draw the arms up, exhale, coming down, swing the arms for one, two, and then lift up. So it's like this, and reaching up, and reaching up and up and up two to go and up and up and then reach those arms all the way out to the side and give yourselves a round of applause for doing your workout today thank you very much indeed do press the like button if you enjoyed the workout today do, do subscribe if you haven't already, that would really help and it'd be much appreciated. And do go check out my other videos, I have lots of standing Pilates videos on the channel, so go ahead and check those out. And have a lovely day, I'll see you really soon, bye for now.